Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to Lumber Tycoon 2. First, before we go anywhere or do anything, I want to make this to your attention. If you're a new viewer, if you've never seen my channel before, right now, go and hit that subscribe button because I was looking over here at my analytics. Let's do this. This is just for the edge works and for the, the time of December 31st to January 2nd. So we've, we've had like three days, okay? N unique viewers, 989. Returning viewers, 850. That means there are more unique viewers watching this video right now who have never subscribed, never gone to the channel. And I'm not, I'm not begging for them. I'm just saying, if you're here, I promise you're gonna have a great time. Hit the subscribe button. Let's go, let's do this. Get, uh, get on the notification squad, hit that little bell. I used to have a little thing where I'd hit it and it would come in and it was like the thing and it was all fancy. That's not what we're doing tonight. Tonight, um, I saw a video that was sent to me by Electrotech over there on Twitter and you have this amazing thing called a door bridge conveyor belt. I want it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, huge shout out to Electrotech for this technology and huge shout out to Jimmy, Jim, 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 I just got, I'm going to call you Jimmy. Um, I've given you credit on some of the videos in the past and in some of the things that you've done. Huge shout out to the wiki. Okay. Without those guys over there doing everything that they do. I don't know. Um, I can tell you right now, my discord server. Okay. So long story short. The wiki used to have a chat. The chat is where I started. I mean, I didn't have Discord. I wasn't a huge YouTuber or anything like that. I started over there in that that chat Discord, or the, the chat from the wiki page, okay? So it's now fandom, but it's still the wiki. Huge, huge shout out to Alexander who is running the whole thing. Um, he, he's amazing. So um, anyhow, Ender. That led to me and uh, one of the fellow wiki members creating a discord called lumber chat discord which we were the owners of for a really long time um we had a little bit of a falling out and i ended up leaving the lcd and the lcd kind of fell into a little bit of a disarray by the way grammy uh miss joe and a couple other people came over with me to create my own discord and that's where my discord started that's why that's why I have what I have now and it's an amazing place if you're if you're not part of the discords um, also the lumber fan group um, it started probably six months after all of the the other discords started and then dark J ended up uh, receiving the the lumber chat discord so the wiki lumber chat discord and the fan group and my discord they all have their own discords but I wanted to let you guys know None of those discords would have started. Nobody would be where they're at without the wiki starting all of that. So I just want to give a huge shout out to the wiki and to all those guys, because you, you guys are the ones who give us all the information on the wiki page. That's where everybody goes. So, oh, man, am I done ranting? I feel good. I feel really good. Okay. It is, it is, um, January 2nd right now. I've already been on keto for 48 hours. I've, I've had two days of keto diet. I'm back in ketosis. I didn't think it, I, I thought it was going to take at least a week before my body would get back into it. No, it took two days. My body's like, we know what's going on. Let's get rid of them carbs. And I, I got my little, myself the little test strips that you pee on. And then it like tells you how many ketones you got and stuff like that. Anyhow, uh, most of you guys don't care about that. I'm going to tell you right now, you might be 10, 11, 12, 13 right now. All right. And some of you are 14, 15, 16, 17. The, the demographic is very weird on this channel. But um, for anybody who is under the age of 30, I'm going to tell you right now, it's going to be a lot harder to get in shape after you graduate college, after you graduate high school. It just changes. It does. And that's part of life. And that's, that's what we do. So to find something that works, I'm ADHD and I don't believe in a lot of things that people tell me like the paleo diet and the Jenny Craig diet and the slim fast. I don't believe them. I don't believe them. I just can't. So when I found out about keto, I was very skeptical and then I started like trying it. It worked. P90X3. Today is the first day that I've been back on it. I just did total synergistics before this. Like I got my hair cut. Listen, it was an awesome day. Okay. 
We took down all the Christmas decorations. Um, I didn't fall asleep during lunch like I normally do because I didn't have any carbs. I was able to run to the store, uh, get stovetop stuffing for the family because they were out. We had pork chops. Uh, took down all the Christmas lights. I ran um, to a couple of different errands. We even ran out and got Starbucks. I was able to get coffee because I can put stevia in it and I had a cold brew. Oh my gosh. Anyhow, after that, we came home and we had dinner. I had pork chops. After dinner, my wife cut my son's hair, my daughter's hair, she trimmed up a little bit, and then she cut my hair, so I have a fresh haircut, looking fresh, feeling good. And then right after that, I did uh, my P90X for the first time in probably four years. I am feeling amazing right now. I just, who cares that I'm playing lumber? I feel good, I really do, I feel great. And it, like I said, if this is your first time on this channel, I don't normally do this kind of stuff. I don't, I don't normally like, brag about all this cool stuff that I did throughout the day, but I'm bragging about it today. Today was fun day and I'm very happy with the way that it, it worked out. Now, the only thing that I think the conveyor belt does is I think that it, it meshes on the same plane. No, 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 no. I don't want to destroy. Excuse me. Okay. That's kind of cool. That doesn't look right though. I think it's got a weld with the door. To the, hold on, let's put something on it. That's not, that's not right. So I may have to go and look at his video for just a second, but I swear it was something just as simple as, as that. Nope, that's not right. Okay. Let's see. Oh, is that a piece of wood? That's not doing it. Okay. So let's put this back. Come here. Come here. I probably should have like watched it thoroughly through the tutorials and stuff like that, but I didn't. So. <laughs> there we go. That looks like it's clipping right on it. Okay. Let's try that. Try that. Did that do it? That does not do it. It's got to be on the same plane. It looks like, what is that? One. It looks like it might be like one floor or one, one tile above where it's supposed to be at. So let's go to floors, large tile, place a large tile down just like that. And then let's take this. No, I don't want that. I want this move. We're just gonna place this right on top of that. So this should now clip. Well, it worked for the short period that was on there. Move B. Hmm. working for the glass door hold on hold on is it working for it's not working for the wood door though well hold up that just kind of worked a little bit but it's right above that that area okay so let's let's try this move B smoother, but still not, not fully going through. Okay. What if we reverse directions and try, oh, come here, come here, and try on the opposite side. Nothing, 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 nothing. Okay. So. <laughs> Move. Let's try this. Let's place a door, hold on, three doors, basic door, and we're going to turn it so it's already on its side. Rotate, whoa, 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 I didn't, no, B, move, move, so, rotate, turn, rotate, turn. We're gonna start you on the side, just like that. Uh, let's see, let's make you out a palm. Boop, there we go, that'll work. 
And let's see here. I think if I move this up here, good. Move this out of the way. No, over there, over there, dude. Just over there, thank you. Move this up, and now let's move the conveyor belt in the way. <laughs> no, 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 no. I got it all kinds of rotated. Ugh, why is it so nasty over here? Hold on. B. Oh, I know why. We've got no light. I've got no light to see my face. I can't see things in my face. We'll turn this car right around. Turn on the lights for me. There we go. So, where did that uh, this thing go over right here? We're gonna move it. Just experimenting, guys. I'm just experimenting. I'm not trying to steal anybody's ideas. I don't care. But I, well, I do care because that was an amazing thing that happened. Ooh. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Wonder if it has something to do with the handle itself. So this. Here. Let's move this out of the way for just a second. I'm gonna need a couple more doors. So. Is this on the ground? No, I lifted it up by one tile, right? Okay. So let's move this over here under the ground, like that. We're gonna move this over here. Rotate, turn, rotate. And you're gonna go on the ground right there, maybe. No, nope, way too far. So I need to come one, two, three. Three units over. <laughs> two right about there. Is that right? No, way off. We need to get bound. There we go. Try that. It should be good. And move B, and it should be stuck. Oh gosh, no. Move B. Are we stuck to the this? Move. Do we, we have to start off with the glass door, don't we? The glass door has got to start it. Okay. I think I've got a glass door over here somewhere. Do I have a glass door? Hello? Is that a glass door? Glass door. There we go. I'm going to move this one right over here. And it's going to go to boops. Going to boop right there. And that's too high off the ground. we got to come put that over there. Drop this right over here. Rotate turn. Boop, like that. Oh gosh. So now I need to move this one out of the way. And let's grab this one. Again, I'm just experimenting. I'm just trying things out. So, right there. Okay. <laughs> move. This should be the same direction, right? Okay. Come here. Why are you not going on there? Please, I want you to get on the board. The dang it. All right, move you off to the side. Move you forward. Rotate turn. Right there, okay. So, this only comes like halfway, right? Yep, halfway through. A little bit less than halfway, but that's fine. Rotate turn, rotate and turn. So, right about there. And attach. Move B. Open the door. Oh snap. There we go. Oh no, we wanted to, to close the door, right? The door is currently open and now it's closed. Okay. So this is default state. So if I move it, B, that's where it lands. It doesn't go upright. So this is the opposite of this kind of door. This is closed state. This is open state. So, this is closed. This is open. So it's kind of the uh, the exact opposite of what we've known in the past. So now we're gonna move this. Rotate turn. Nope, I need to get the, uh, the tile out of the way. All right, here we go. Move. Move the tile. Oh, come here. Move. Okay. 
Come on, guys. Let's do this. I think it's got to be on the handle, so rotate. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Down. Oh, that's nowhere near it. Why is it underneath? What? Does it think that those doors are still there? On the server side? Is that what's going on? Because it's not going on the ground. Hmm. 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 Not good. Hmm. Move. See, I'm not going to be able to move it in there. It pops up one. <laughs> hmm. Yep. It still determines that there is a door there, even after that happens. So, let's see. Move. Oh, oh. Poop. Where did it go? Ah, dang it. Now that's on the ground. Why is that not? Hmm. I know I don't have to glitch that if I can do it the base load, but the glass doors now load faster on the glass or on the on the bases. Hmm. Am I gonna need an alternative for this? I might need an alternative account. Let's go see if I can fire up Sample Life. Hold up. Okay, here we go. And for those of you asking, hey Code, how did you do that? Um, I'm running the the application that comes from the website, from roblox.com, and I'm running the one that you get from the Windows Store. Technically, they are two different executables, and yes. Uh, oh, by the way, this is my alt account, Samper Life. Hello, everyone. Um, and this is my Code Primate base. So I've got Sam and I've got Code. Hello, everybody. Oh gosh, stuck, stuck, stuck. There we go. Hi, Code. There we go. Hey, Sam. How you doing, buddy? Okay, so I need to move this. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, not me. Uh, it's got to be Sam. Sam's got to move it. So, okay, first off, whitelist code. Good. By the way, never whitelist anybody that. Um, that you do not trust or you do not know. Sam, can I trust you? Yeah, you could trust me, dude. All right, cool. So, uh, he is going to move this. Uh, yes. And then over here on my code primate, I'm going to go whitelist and we're going to unwhitelist him, which by the way, you can see that this is still existing for code primate, but that's because Sam is trying to move it. This is this is what I've been talking about with the server and cl client stuff all the time. Same thing with the door bridges happens. If we hit B on Sam, it does not place. So technically it's invisible. So you can see it over here on Code Primate. Yay, it exists. Over here on Sam, it does not. Okay. That's the bug. That's how you glitch build. That's, that's how this stuff works. Okay. Uh, so we can go ahead and let's see. Oh, oh, I can't do anything. Oh, that's because I unwhitelisted him. Whitelist, Sam. There you go, buddy. All right, so he should be able to move. We're going to move this out the way. And then we are going to move this. No, we're just going to move the door. Move the door and rotate, turn, rotate. Turn, turn, like that. Now, where does that exist? Oh, no. Move. All right, so I need to do a turn, turn, rotate, rotate. There we go. Because as soon as it opens, we're going to close it again. There we go. <laughs> so, looks like if, if I look over on code, that's too far back. Hold on, over here on code, is it is it on the ground? Yeah, it is on the ground. So, it looks like we're going to need to lift it by one tile. So Sam, before you put that down, you're gonna put down a tile first. All right, 
remove the tile. Rotate turn. Boop. Like that. And it is existing. Kind of weird, but that's that's fine. And then this we're going to move. And it's gonna go. Rotate turn, rotate turn. Right here. Like that. Maybe. Possibly. It does not look like it attached to the conveyor belt. Hold on. It did not attach to the conveyor belt. So, we need to move this back slightly more. We're going to move it back like, what, two units? Let's see. One, two. Two units. Make sure it's lined up. Okay. So over here on Code Primate, it's now right there, smack dab in the middle. So Sam should be able to open this, boop, like that. And then we come over here, we're gonna put down a fat door, just like a so. And now this should attach, move, B, and yay, okay. So we have a little bit of progress. Now, let's check with uh, code here and put something on here. Nope, looks like the conveyor belt is working, but the door itself is not. So, move B. No, it's just on the conveyor belt. So, <clears throat> again, experimenting, trying to figure it out. Let's uh, let's switch back over to Sam, and we're going to go ahead and move this door out of the way. Move. You're going to go over there, and move. You're going to go over there. What do you think? Maybe one more tile, and get it up off the uh, the floor there. So, oh, I don't have any blueprints. Only he has blueprints. So. Go to floor, we're gonna go to large tile. Oh, 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 oh. Place one down like that. Switch back over to Sam. Now we should be able to move. Oh gosh. <clears throat> Rotate turn. Like that. And take a door. Move. Rotate, turn, rotate, turn. Is that on the thing? It did attach, but here. Hmm. So let's go ahead and open the door. And we're going to drop this one right down here. Gosh, these are so hard to move in place. Okay. Okay, that one should attach. Move. B. Yay. So let's switch back over to code. Gonna go move. B. Okay. Moment of truth. And the moment of truth is, it doesn't work. Dang it. What about a smaller piece? Small small piece? Does a small piece work? Does not. Dang it. Okay. <clears throat> so. Hmm. Electro? My hat off to you. Because I don't know how you've done this. I will I will go back and I will explore your uh, your video. A little bit more. I, I will try and pay attention this time because my ADHD has been, just been taken off with me this whole time. But uh, that's it for now because I got to get. We're, we're running out of time. We're at the 24 minute mark. That's like 15 minutes past the normal time that I would have normal. Long story short, thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate, as I try and figure out the conveyor door belt system, uh, door bridge conveyor belt system. I don't know. 
Anyhow, I'm going to go check it out. I'm going to learn a little bit more and hopefully I can figure it out before the next video. Um, I'm super excited because of the potential of this thing and what we could do with it. If you could stand on your base and have wood directly dropped off to the wood drop off. Oh my gosh, guys, that that is amazing. Now, it, there was something to do with trucks and welds and stuff like that. So I'm going to have to figure that out as well. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Askins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos like a good YouTuber does. It's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. You were here, you watched, you had fun. Sam, you want to say some good words? Thank you everyone for watching this episode. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Thanks, Sam. Appreciate it. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon.